today really a bit of a special request is the Maxon MX1000 which is a CPT only FM radio uh, we've got a circuit for it we've got a block diagram for it and I'll just have to make up a bit of a servicing thing so this is one we bought on eBay I wouldn't have paid much it's pretty immaculate because I'm not into CPT only sets CPT doesn't work in this area very well and um, I don't know anybody who uses it everybody's using CB2781 here so there we are so I'm going to open it up we'll see what greets us well, of course, the circuit diagram we've got is a photocopy of a photocopy. The block diagrams have some help, and I've been able to do up a little chart of adjustments, hopefully. So we switch it on these default to channel 9. They have a three wire power lead. You've got two positives and a negative, so you can have a constant uh, power there for the memory backup. Right, so that's on channel 20. We're going to transmit, and of course, it should be 27205. We've got no transmit at all. That could, of course, be a Duff mic. I'll just plug the extension speaker in and just see if we've got any receive. This is a set which has a S meter socket on the back, which can be useful for an external S meter. Okay, well, we'll assume the mic's wired wrongly or faulty. So we'll take it from there. Okay, so uh, we'll start with the tune up. Um, got a wire, seems to have wired the mic something near. Um, the mic it came with wasn't wired anything like. It's a six pin plug on these. Um, right, from what I've worked out, L301 is our first transmit one. And I'll just see if we can get a peek on that, which we can. Next is L210. Oh, well, straight out of the uh, off the shelf, it's doing 2.7 watts. Let's brought it up a bit. 209. Two oh eight Presume that's one in there. That's not making much difference. And we know that uh, the power set control is R V one oh three, which is the one there's a preset just there. That was actually on full. So at the moment we're just doing a shade under 3 watts, this is probably how it's going to be. So I'll go through these again. So it's L301, L210, L209. Two eight, and I presume that one's on the receive. I'll just prove it. Yeah, I don't know what's under there. This doesn't make any difference, and um, we we'll still remain at, um, at just a shade under three watts. I'm just checking that on the others. Yep. Just, uh, just we could say it's three watts. Right, we'll pop it onto frequency, and it's CT1, CT1. There's the synthesizer chip just down the front here, and there's a red trimmer capacitor somewhere amongst the jumble of wires. 
There we are. I'll just zoom in on that, hopefully. That's that one there. Doesn't matter how many years I do this job, always make it the rock make it go the wrong way. There we go, 27205, spot on. So I've just pulled it down a little bit. Now it's got a fairy light display. Like that, and all four are lighting up. I'd like it to be just, because it's only giving three watts, I'd like it to show that it's only just giving three watts. And it's not the one which we've been able to work out. So we're just going to do a bit of trial and error on this. Uh, I've got a choice here of two which we couldn't determine. What isn't that? It doesn't appear to be that either. No, oh, right, well. Right, well, by turning the power down to about 100 milliwatts, I've discovered that it's actually the variable resistor there, which is the TX power meter. Just make a note on my plan there. But it makes so little difference, we've still got a full um, lot of four lights with the maximum output which is just about 3 watts on this radio. So we've covered that. Next we need to just look at deviation. Well, I've just done a quick whistle test and discovered it's doing something like 4 kilohertz deviation. So we'll just address that. Wallo, one, two. According to what I've been able to work out, I'll just put the oscillator on. It should be RV104, which is the one just there in the middle. My goodness, it goes capable of going very, very high. Well, that's set that to two and a half. We'll just check with the whistle test. <whistles> Wallow. And that looks about right. So that concludes the transmit side of the CPT Maxon MX 1000.